Hello there, this is Dave Motohead out here at the ranch working on the iron tire machine today to uh, get rid of a bunch of old tires I don't need. Anyway, I thought I'd just make a video and go through that with you, so let me put the hat cam on and see if this works. Hat cam in place. Oh, I think I need my gloves. Yeah, time to clean up the old shop, too. Kind of got a mess going in here. Anyway, what I'm doing today is got the old Coats Iron Tire Man. At least that's what it's called. And I got this big pile of Corvair wheels here. And I want to get rid of all these things for mom it's Mother's Day after all so let's go over here and find our next victim see if we can find a good one yeah this looks like a good one ah. really funny a lot of these old tires are old outdated ones and they've got all kinds of old old tire markings and stuff I haven't seen forever anyway this is the tire machine what you got here is you got this little guy spring loaded that goes up through one of the holes here and this little clamp hooks onto the little thing down here that clamps it so you wanna put this dude on there like that and go down in here and put the little tire dealy through there and then you want to hit the foot pedal that clamps down the clamp and uh, then we want to take our old tire weights off come on baby wants to be difficult. I've been saving tire weights. And then we want to pop the bead. Now the first bead is this little guy down here which goes up inside. You gotta kind of yank it on. And it pops the bottom bead. Then you gotta go around and make sure that it's popped all the way around and it is and then the next tool we take is the top bead breaker which slides over the top and then I have a extension bar I like to use get in there like that just like that pops the old bead off that sucker And then, we want to pour us a little bit of soapy water around that old thing so it'll come off. Mom wants me to get these old tires out of here and I can't blame her. And I don't want to throw away the rims because these are all good 13 inch Corvair rims. So, the next tool is the bead breaker bar, which you just kind of stick in there like that you flip it over and then I like to take this extension pipe because it makes it easier and you get on the back side of it here and just start iron tire man it just sucker off and we got half of it and then you want to go down in here get the other half Yeah. Iron, you gotta go fast sometimes. Ah, get that sucker off there. There we go. That's why they call it the Iron Tire Man. Because you gotta be an Iron Man to get it off there. 
what is this this is an old Remington tire and uh, this one here is a, a metalist an old tire can you imagine driving on them old tires and what is this one this one's a safety safety prima safety prima anyway so you take that off there and let the foot pedal up and you take the old Corvair wheel and you roll it that one's got a little ding in the in the thingy and then we take it over here and we stack it on the pile of Corvair wheels there's a four bolter so if anybody wants Corvair wheels that aren't all rusted up I got some of them so there you go this is the old uh, the donor car I'm cutting up got a hole there for uh, I sold the floorboard and sold the dashboard and uh, there's some of the other other projects I got sitting around here but anyways I got all these tires to uh, take rims off and uh, looks like there's a good four bolt early wheel right there for my next victim I need to get this stuff done before my mom uh, throws me out of the shop here anyways I'm Dave Motohead and that's how you work the iron tire man makes you an iron tire man after a while anyways thanks for watching